Lord said, I need to hear from you. I need you to walk with me, to talk with me. I need you in my life. That's the only thing I'm necessitating in this season. Everything else and everybody else can get lost because business is business. Sufficient grace. This is the very reason that God allows things to die in your life. Because without the death of something, uh, he would never give life to the next thing in your life. Uh, that's why the friendships, some of them, they have to die. Uh, the marriages, it goes to fire. The jobs, they act upon you. The money acts funny. The change acts strange. Uh, the credit don't let it and the checkbook just won't look. I feel like preaching. Uh, because God is getting you in a position now to worship. Uh, because when you start dying, uh, it means now that you get very, very desperate. Uh, and it's only when we are desperate that we begin now to seek him with due diligence. Uh, it's only when death begins to occur, you remember Isaiah, we begin to see him the same way that Isaiah saw him. Isaiah said, I saw him fill the temple as I am lifted up. I feel my preaching in this place. I feel the power of the Holy Ghost and the Bible declares that this man is desperate. The Bible lets us know that his daughter is ill. There's a tragedy in his house. There's something going on that he can't begin to control. Many times, sufficient grace, the problem in the church is, is that we want to be in control. Huh? We fall in love with control. Huh? But what God will begin to do in our lives huh? is that God will begin to give you such an encounter, such an experience, huh? so that you can see who really is in control. Huh? Anytime something is going wrong, huh? going all hell wire, everything is breaking loose in your life and shipwreck is gone. Huh? Get ready for something right to happen. Huh? Get ready for something to burst out in your life. Huh? The Lord tell me to tell the house of sufficient grace, international ministry, just like this, huh? that deliverance huh? is steal the children's bread and if God be gone in your life get ready for some folks to get lost because sufficient grace is time to get down to business business is still business and your business is your father's business this is why Jesus in the book of John says I abide in him as he abide in me in other words I got a connection I got a conjoinment I got an association that when I begin to tap in I don't look at the things that are seen I look at the things that are unseen I don't look at the natural, I look at the supernatural. In other words, there are times in my life when I'm just like Clark Kent. But if I spin around on you, I could pull out a super 